Yeah, I think uh, I think they'd be very easy to work on for uh, minor maintenance anyways. Yeah, anything that uh, someone would be willing to tackle. Yeah, nothing's, uh, there's not a bunch of uh, wires and hoses all over the place. Uh, like some of these new vehicles that you look under the hood and you don't even know if there's an engine in there. Uh, yeah, everything seems to be uh, laid out nicely. Um, the mechanical drive makes it so much more uh, simple, um, easy to maintain. And I know from other people that use that type of a sprayer, the hydrostat system, you know, they're spending so much time uh, on maintenance and, uh, you know, they're spending a lot of time in the shop where I don't want to be in the shop. I want to be, you know, in the field basically. So, um, and other, other things like uh, in the cab, you know, there, there's not a lot of uh, clutter in the cab, very simple. All the electronics are very straightforward to use. Just simple. I mean, uh, there's no wheel motors, there's no hydraulics, there's no hoses, there's, and, and the mechanical drive is just so simple. I mean, it's, it's trouble free. You know, a lot of times if there is an issue with the sprayer, uh, it's something that I can deal with myself because of its simplicity, where, where I know other sprayers, if there's an issue, you know, you got to have a tech out or, you know, get it right into the shop. So um, I r have rarely had problems with Apache throughout the years with, you know, mechanical problems. But a lot of times if I do, um, I c it's usually a quick fix right here on the farm and I'm, I'm back in the field. It's basically got a drive shaft. I could definitely fix the drive shaft. Um, the engine, I mean, as far as servicing and everything goes, we, we do that, but uh, I wouldn't be afraid to tackle some of the stuff underneath, and what I don't tackle, I think has got a, I hope has got a pretty long life that I don't need to get into it, but uh, uh, I don't see a whole bunch that's going to go wrong with it, so, um, you know, the screens, everything are pretty accessible, and, you know, the maintenance that I have to do uh, on it, I feel fairly comfortable doing, and, and uh, I'm a pretty busy guy, so if it's anything too major, I just get my dealer to do it anyway. But uh, no, it's it's uh, it's pretty simple. It's still like it's a simple drivetrain machine. I think if you had if you had to get it into the shop and do some work yourself, it probably could you probably could manage it for the most part. Engine-wise, you know, depending on any problems you have with them. But like I said, the dealership here has been very accommodating to us and. They help us out quite a bit if we have any problems, which have been few and far between. Yeah, the simplicity is what we really liked about it. I mean, everything's right there in front of you. There's, it's a mechanical drive, so you see the drive line, all the parts that go with it. And you know what? We've had one for four or five years now. We can't say enough about it. It's really simple. No issues, relatively no issues.